Good morning. Sunday morning. Happy Sunday. Welcome to Z Education and welcome to another episode of You Laugh, You Lose. If you are new to this channel and new to this series, the game is simple. If you laugh at anything, you lose, you do a punishment. What is today's punishment? Today's punishment is if you are watching this show with somebody else, whoever laughs first makes dinner. Okay? If you're watching this show alone, you have to make dinner for yourself and it can't be cereal. Look, we've been over this. Cereal does count occasionally, but that's not tonight. Tonight you have to make yourself real dinner. All right? Pretty simple punishment, if you ask me. If you accept the terms of today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you laugh, you lose, go. The hairstyles of the 80s were the best. I'm 56. The higher the hair, the closer to God. <laughs> Is that what you guys said? Did you guys really say that? I mean, it's true. It's true, yes, but I, I love that that was acknowledged. How much uh, hairspray did you guys go through at your house? That's what I want to know, because that couldn't have been cheap. I noticed your ad only went back to 1950. What were you doing in the 1940s? <laughs> what were you doing, Volkswagen? No lie. Adult life summed up. You can't just quit. You have bills to pay. Dude. I, there. Yeah, that's kind of depressing, actually. Because it's true. We're all sucked into bills, right? Most lead, most men lead quiet lives of desperation. Ever heard that one? We won't get into it, but third grade, we had a prison guard do a scared straight speech and we asked what the prisoners ate. He said, nothing good. McDonald's burgers. And when he saw our faces light up, he said, yeah, but imagine that three times a week. That was when he lost control of the room. <laughs> sort of like campaigning about the good side of prison. McDonald's three times a week? Really, that doesn't seem that bad. By the way, have you guys seen that show? We've mentioned it a few times before, but go find old clips of that show. It's wild. I cannot believe that was a thing. I mean, honestly, if it was on Netflix, if they made like a modern series of Scared Straight, I would watch it like as soon as it dropped. Kurt Cobain's daughter and Tony Hawk's son are now married. They're going to create the coolest white person ever. That's, that's incredible. I didn't know that that they were married and uh, that might be the coolest baby ever for sure. Where were you yesterday? There was nobody else to cover your shift. I'm sorry, I was becoming a father yesterday. Oh really? I'm happy for you, boy or girl. I'll tell you, mm. uh, <laughs> you're fired. You are fired. You're fired. This is a terrible joke. Skip and work. Get to work. Netflix should have a category called easy to follow while looking at your phone the whole time called trailer park boys and previously the office you put it on in the background it says some background noise so you don't feel so lonely you know <laughs> favorite pizza topping by state pennsylvania's corn minnesota's tuna this is so bs avocado who puts avocado on their pizza who made this this is so bs dude i've never seen a single pizza place have tuna on their pizza. You know what is good? This is this is for real. Dill pickle pizza. Just had it for the first time. Not bad. Joe Biden almost threw a single sentence. Democrats. Oh, <laughs> uh, we gotta be fair here. There's you know, there are some Republicans too that this is this applies to. Congress is old, man. Shout out to the only chip company that doesn't sell air. <laughs> That's it, you know, true, you know, the, uh, the best idea, this has been on many memes before, but I, I don't see it anywhere still. So, but like the deodorant spinning thing at the bottom of the deodorant, right? You spin it and the deodorant go, goes up. They need to make that for the can. So you don't have to reach down in there. That would make it better, but we'll see. The ice cream God smiled down upon me today. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. That's hilarious. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even know if I would eat that because that, that shows me that somebody wasn't doing their job. That's what that shows me. And you don't know what kind of salmonella is in there. That's just, that's just me. Taylor Swift going from one side of her plane to the other side. 
I have to say, it's probably the best one I've seen. There's so many Taylor Swift jokes about a private jet now, but I like this one the best. That's a really nice plane, by the way, if that's real. Has anyone here flown on a private jet? Never have. I flew first class one time to our honeymoon. That's it. And it was pretty awesome. What are the best examples of boring technology that work exceptionally well and aren't overhyped? Created the Western world. Yep. That little Allen wrench. I think I have probably 50 of those things. They're all the same size. Because of all the stupid Ikea furniture I have to put together. I hate it. I hate it. Uh, you know, this is a good time. I'm going to do a little promotion here. Next Sunday, episode 200. Be there. You guys, you guys do not want to miss episode 200. Okay? So something important is happening on that day. And it is, it is important that every single subscriber here sees it so we can get the record straight. Okay? Okay? German chocolate cake. Originating in the United States, it was named after English-American chocolate maker Samuel German. Are you serious? So it's not actually German. It's named after Samuel German. That is so stupid. Wow, what a fraud! Every once in a while, I go outside and run the vacuum cleaner over the driveway just to ensure that my neighbors never talk to me. <laughs> well, I don't know what your kid's doing in the corner, because but he's helping out. He's just squatting in the corner looking into the corner. That's that's even even more weird. Neighborhood, stay away from that family. 50-year-old plane in my head. 50-year-old plane in reality. Dude, our, our jets are getting old. Really old. They're flying those back in Vietnam, man. Uh, what is that, F-16 right there? F-15s are, I think, a little bit older even. I might be wrong on that. But when she finds out, you invested in Bitcoin in 2009. <laughs> <laughs> if you invested in Bitcoin in 2009, you were ahead of your time for sure. Uh, but if you also, if you did within like a year ago, if you were buying a year ago, I love you. I was buying a year ago. I have to, I have to admit it's been like the last three years, every couple weeks, you know, just a little bit here and there. A lot of people are like, no, 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 don't do it. That's up to you. You do what you want. If you bought in 2009, you're sitting pretty good. That one time you farted in a patient's room and nurse thought the patient had a bowel movement. <laughs> so you helped the nurse check. It's disgusting. That is absolutely disgusting and shame on you. You let the patient take the blame. All right, if you're watching this, you're, you're making dinner for your whole house for the rest of the week. All right? That is messed up. <laughs> Perfect stick or perfect rock? Which one you take it? <sighs> Gotta go rock. Yeah, it's pretty rare that you find a rock like that. You can pretty easily find a stick. Not to mention if you get into a battle, you know, you got distance with the rock. You can hit, you have to, you have one shot. You have one shot to make the rock hit, but you still have that one shot first. You get the first shot, so... You hit, you steal the stick, and you got both. So that's just, there's my, my thought process there. Let me know in the comments. Rock or stick? My brother vacuum sealed the only scissors in the house. <laughs> that is messed up. He's used a knife, but uh, it's the intention. It's the, it's the middle finger that counts. That's messed up. This is an actual monument in the USA. I'd fight to retake this during a foreign invasion. <laughs> You know, I'll be right there with you. I will. That's that's one we can't we can't let go. When you tell your child to pick a bedtime book and they pick one of these. Oh, dude. I know this one too. That I like these ones sometimes. I mean they're kind of hard to read, but you get to have fun with them. You can do funny voices and, and uh say funny things and the kids usually love it. But some nights it's like, no. What about the hungry caterpillar? I love that book. It's short. It's got a good lesson. You love it. Like nostalgia from your childhood. Raise your scooters. This is a true story. We made, you know how like you have the bikes that have two people. I can't remember what they're called. Two. Sometimes they have a third person and it's like one bike, but there's three seats and you all get to pedal. We did that with scooters. We had four of them. And it was the worst idea of all time. It was, it was a really bad idea. We took off the back, the front wheel attach it to the back wheel of the next one and so on for four of them 
And we did that. It was, we thought we had this innovative idea. It was a terrible idea. Don't do that. If I won Powerball, I'd buy every single Taylor Swift ticket and be like, honestly, kind of a waste of money. I have to say that. And um, very expensive. I mean, that's got to be a lot of money. Powerball might cover it. Throwback to my costume for World Book Day 2009. <laughs> Dude, if you did this in 2024, you would be all over. You'd be blasted for this. But you are playing the character. <laughs> San Francisco either has a huge homeless problem or a gigantic camping success story. I'm going with camping success story. We gotta, let's be positive here. What's on your mind? Me. Money? Uh, all right. What do they say? What's that? What is that? that passage uh he who loves money will never have enough think about that one it's true butcher open dear vegans i've killed this cow because it was eating your food you're welcome uh the same person who's gonna melt down here you spelled your wrong okay i hate to do it to you <laughs> but i'm gonna do it before they do it doordash but it's me delivering a knuckle sandwich to your doorstep <laughs> this is a little knuckle sandwich with some mayonnaise. Maybe some mustard. Some mustard mayonnaise sandwich. Please hold my hand and walk next to me. Kid. <laughs> Kids, man. Kids. When I guess the right size socket on the first try. Damn, I'm good. I am always impressed with that. When, uh, you know, you're doing some work and all of a sudden you say, oh, we gotta need a... Now oh, I gotta do this and that, and there's a bolt here. Gotta get a socket. Yeah, try 14 mil, and it's 14 mil. That's impressive. Gonna tell my kids this is Pat McAfee. <laughs> now that's funny. Gonna tell my daughters that too. When you change it to classic rock, expecting Led Zeppelin, but get Weezer. All right, I listen to uh, classic rock occasionally here. Has anyone actually heard this on a classic rock station? Weezer with the freaking Beatles or, you know, Ario Speedwagon, Led Zepp, Pink Floyd. Is that real? Whoever's making cheese commercials can save their money. We're buying cheese and we're never going to stop buying cheese. I don't, yeah, I don't know why they do that, honestly. It's just like the toilet paper thing. No one's not going to not buy toilet paper. Everyone's, no one's going to not buy cheese unless they have a severe lactose intolerant problem, you know? Parent hack. Make yourself a nice little lunch out of your kid's scraps. Yeah, and then they start freaking out because you're eating it. So, well, you're not going to eat it, but it's mine. Yeah, I know, but you're not eating it. I was gonna, It's going to throw it away. I don't, it's mine. Yeah, so. <laughs> Have fun. They. Breakup hurts the most. Me. You ever had this? <laughs> Dude, that. Okay, all right. That hurts a little bit more than a breakup. It does. And then it's there for like weeks because it keeps getting caught on your your bottom tooth there. Oh, that is just awful, man. Life before internet. Those were the days, man. You, you literally just hung out outside. You just sat outside. It was awesome. Just hung out outside. Me casually eating popcorn out of the bowl. Me and all my siblings have projectile vomited in throughout our childhood. It's always, everyone has that bowl. It's disgusting. Why do we do that? Don't leave your Easter bunny in the car. Jeez. Yeah, that's weird. That's, that's like terrifying. Don't do that. Bet you can't hit me with a quarter. See, I love this. Those creative signs like that, I'm, I'm giving a quarter to them. I'm doing it. I love that. Pooping Palace. Thai cuisine. I hope that's fake. I hope this is someone trying to make a joke. I don't know if I want to eat at that place if it's real. It looks like Lightning McQueen paved this road. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. City work at its finest, mate. Come on. If women get paid less, we should pay less taxes. That's how taxes work. <laughs> Dude, look at that ratio. Yeah, look at that ratio. Um... Yeah, if you make less money, you pay less taxes. Unless you have a business and you can write things off. I'm telling you, it, like 
if you have a W-2, you're getting scammed. I've recently, like in the last two, three years, learned how taxes work, like in depth. And it, it's insane. It's insane the loopholes out there. Blaming her for slavery is like blaming her for Pearl Harbor. So I can't really argue that. That's, you know, the past the past, right? A lot of people don't think like that, unfortunately. The State Department nailed my girlfriend's passport. <laughs> well, good. Nice. You're a conehead. I don't know if you knew that or not, but now you know. <laughs> I love that. Uh, now you get to go and get every time you go through the passport lane, you get laughed at, unfortunately. So many people need a hug, a forehead kiss, and a grilled cheese cut diagonal. <laughs> that looks good. That looks real good. Um, it cures the soul. It does. Nice little homemade grilled cheese. Okay. I'm all for innovation, but this one's a little dangerous. Not to mention you're going to rip off some freaking sheetrock when you take that down. If it doesn't fall down. When you watch a YouTube tutorial to do maintenance on your car, and now it won't turn on. <laughs> Dude, I've used YouTube so much on my vehicles. There's always a YouTube video for whatever. If you can figure out how to describe it right and figure out and diagnose exactly what's wrong, then uh, there is a YouTube video for your ailment. I, and, and the year, the model of your car, it's all there. Someone did it. It might only have 20 views on it, but someone made a tutorial on it. And those are true heroes. They are. Diet Spoon and Fork. What about their hands? What are you going to do there? Dumb. I'm going to thin Logan back to the Japanese fourth. You guys, I don't, I, I cannot believe how many people are saying that Jake Paul is going to win. Mike Tyson's going to destroy him. Did you see the videos of him training? He looks like he's 40, max. He, I mean, he's throwing some nice, some nice hooks. A lot of power. I, I'm actually scared for Jake Paul. Truly. Hey, kid, here's some identification you'll need for the rest of your life, but you're not allowed to laminate it. We went ahead and printed it on gas station toilet paper for you. And then when you need it, when it does look like this, you don't remember where you put it. You have a box of all your important stuff, but for some reason it's not in there. Dude, that's that stupid card. Her. I bet he's thinking of other women. Him. If the Goo Goo Dolls and Lady Gaga ever go on tour together, it can be called the Goo Goo Gaga Tour. That's, uh, that's the kind of things... That's the kind of stuff that goes through our head, ladies. It is. Me. I promise I won't get all political. Three drinks later. U.S. to Annex Canada. <laughs> Make it happen. Come on. Come on, Manitoba. Saskatchewan. Alberta. Come on, guys. Come on. You can be a new Dakota. In Finland, we have one-person benches because we don't like getting too close to other people. Me. How much is a flight to Finland? I love it. Finland's got it right, man. Sometimes you just need your space, dude, even out in public. Well, always out in public. Don't ever get in someone else's space. You should sign up for our 401k. I can't run that far. <laughs> it's like a, that's like a Michael joke. You can say, okay, John Mayer, to any white dude playing guitar and it drives them nuts. It's the greatest thing ever. Go try it, dude. It is. <laughs> I play guitar. I love, I, I know several John Mayer songs. Guy wails. He, he does. He, he's a great guitarist. It's a great compliment. Can we talk about how cute motorcycle gangs are? Inseparable friends, matching outfits, going on adventures together. What wholesome, adorable fun. Lucky ducks. <laughs> I want you to say this to the next motorcycle gang you come across. This exact thing. Oh, you guys are cute. The raccoon clip when Tyler says, don't feed them or they'll become dependent and won't be able to survive on their own. He was accidentally describing the welfare system in the U.S. Dude, there are people that fall in hard times. I get that. And I, I'm not saying we don't need something. But uh, it does create dependency. It do, there's lots of clips of people talking about it. It's like, why would I work when I can get this? So it's a, it's a fine line to ride. And we are way past the line. So you're right. Yes, you are 100% right. The three stages of career development. I can't wait until I'm important enough to be included in meetings. Two, I feel important being in these meetings. Three, I'll do anything legal and several illegal things to avoid these meetings. <laughs> 
It's the worst, dude. My nail guy got no effing chill. See you then, and we can go from there. Okay, love. Hi, dear. Hey, Kong. How are you? This is Kong wife. Just let you know that Kong passed away two days ago. What? Yes. Just kidding. It is me, LOL. Kong WTF. Dude, that is, that is not a nice joke. <laughs> Look, that might be acceptable in other places in the world, but that's messed up, dude. <laughs> Jewish Community Center, Mrs. Weiner, Mrs. Mrs. Weiner, and Mrs. Butte. Grow up. It's their names. Okay, don't laugh at that. Text to my husband in 2009. Come over. I'm still up. Text to my husband in 2024. He pooped his pants. She just did a huge poop. <laughs> Code Brown, help. Help need a backup. Call him backup. It's funny how it changes. Yeah, it is. It's what happens. A large boulder the size of what? Large boulder the size of a small boulder is completely blocking eastbound lane highway 145. <laughs> Please use caution. A large boulder the size of a small boulder. Um... Whoever wrote that, whoever manages that Twitter account, you're fired. Charcuterie boards are like babies because anyone can make them and everyone thinks the one they made is great. <laughs> Look, I, again, that's a, that's a topic on this channel too. I like charcuterie boards. Like, f I like food. If it's there, I'm going to eat it. But I don't want to, I don't want to spend $60 on one. Okay. I, I think that's a scam. In October of 1994, Pulp Fiction, Forrest Gump, The Shawshank Redemption, and Jurassic Park were all in theaters at the same time. Dude. Literally, uh, it might be the best year of film in history. Back before, like, everything was just pure entertainment, pure for the story. You know, now everything, there's like an agenda in every single film. Like, let's, let's go, like, can we move back to that? Let's like, let's shrink it down to, you know what, screw it. Let's get rid of all streaming platforms. And I mean that. Let's bring back movie theaters. Let's like hype up the movie theaters again. Let's bring back video rental stores. Like truly, let's do it. Let's go back in time, man. In Canada, our Fords come with heated bumpers. So your hands don't get cold while pushing them. da -dum. Ting! Nice one. I like it. It's true. If they sold this in theaters instead of popcorn, I'd be happy. A lot to ask of the theater. You know, you got to get a fryer. Got to get a good fry cook. But that would be amazing. Honestly. They, they, they would sell a lot of fries. That, that's the problem. I don't know if they could keep up. How to get two people into a movie with one ticket. Yeah. Dude. We talk about innovation on this channel. And this is what it's, this is what it's all about, man. Yeah. The effort to put into this. You're stealing, you are, and you should go pay. But the fact that you did this, and this could be applied elsewhere, you know, amazing. Google Pixel Buds for 159 can translate 40 languages in real time in your ear. The Babble Fish is here. Nail salon gonna be lit. <laughs> Kong's gonna love that one. As a white person, I do not have a second fridge in my garage. It's in my basement. I don't have a second fridge in my garage or basement, but I do have a second freezer in the garage. My second fridge is in the man cave. <laughs> no fridge or freezer in the garage, but one fridge and two freezers in the basements and a fridge in my office man space games room thing. <laughs> Can we play the clip that the guy was like, why does all of his white friends, they all have a, a second fridge for beverages? <laughs> Question for white people. Why do you guys always have a second fridge in your garage. Hey, I'm black and have a garage fridge, a backyard trampoline, and my sister's boyfriend made himself a little corner in the garage that's something like a man cave. Wait, I also voted for Trump. Was Biden right? I hit black? <laughs> Tamara, those are Biden's words, you know? He might be right. The fridge thing, I don't, I don't know if that applies. I, I, I think in Biden's country, yes. Yes. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> How would you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose. Everyone loses. And you have to watch next Sunday's video, episode 200 of You Laugh, You Lose. And it's a, it's a very important one, guys.
Also, if you laugh first with someone else, you have to make dinner tonight. And if you're watching alone and you laugh, you have to make dinner for yourself. No, cereal doesn't count. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed, and this is Education. The beer brewed here, it is used to make the brew beer. Idiots.